Hey, man, I'm Jessica from ProudMoney.com. Chase has just posted the 5% or 5 points per dollar categories for the Chase Freedom Flex for the first quarter of 2024. And those categories are grocery stores, excluding Walmart and excluding Target, fitness clubs and gym memberships, and then a what I believe is a new category for Chase, and it is spa services and self-care. And so you will get the 5% cash back or five points per dollar in the Chase Ultimate Rewards program on up to $1,500 of purchases in those three categories combined. All other purchases with the card get you 1%. And then of course, if you go beyond $1,500 within the first quarter on those 5% or five uh, point per dollar categories, those would go down to 1% as well. The first quarter runs from January 1st, 2024 through March 31st of 2024. And remember, you do have to activate in order to get the 5% on those categories. The nice thing with Chase is they will let you activate almost all the way until the end of the quarter, and you can still retroactively get the 5% on any purchases that you have made in those categories. So even if you don't activate for a while and tell them, yes, I want the uh, 5%, you'll still be able to get credit for all of those categories. Now, many people that have the Chase Freedom Flex card also hold the Discover It card, the 5% categories for the Discover It card for the first quarter of 2024, if you did not already know are restaurants and drugstores. So we don't have any overlap here in the first quarter. So if you're someone that holds both of those cards, you can look forward to getting 5% on a wide range of purchases in that first quarter. So how do we feel about those 5% categories? Well, 5% at grocery stores is always nice. If you don't have another credit card where you're getting 5%, well then obviously that's gonna make you happy here in the first quarter of 2024. The uh, gym memberships, fitness clubs, obviously when you start over a new year, people make their new year's resolutions, the new year, new you kind of thing. So if you're someone that uh, potentially is going to do that, or you're already uh, you know, a member of a fitness club or gym, well then obviously you can get your 5% there, so that might make you feel good. The self-care spa services, we're going to need a little more information as to what exactly that all encompasses but sort of goes hand in hand with the fitness clubs. So I think it really depends on if you spend a good amount of money on things like that to, you know, wherever you work out or if you use spa services, that kind of stuff, maybe that is something you would get excited about. The grocery stores, again, is nice, but there are a lot of uh, a lot more cards on the market these days where you can get a pretty nice uh, rebate on your grocery store purchases. So it kind of depends on what else you have in your wallet. Anyway, I'd love to hear what you think of it, depending on what you have in your particular wallet. Put that in the comments section below. Otherwise, I thank you for watching. And as always, please go to proudmoney.com where we do credit card reviews. We talk personal finance, we talk deals, and all sorts of other fun stuff too. If you're not going to leave a comment or go to the website, you might want to watch next this video.